What's going on, guys and gals, ladies and gentlemen, children of all ages? This is still Winston here. Welcome to my channel. Today we are carrying on with my KOTOR Let's Play. In the last episode, we joined the Sith Academy on Korriban. Ah, oh, there you are. My favorite Thomas. prospect for the year. What do you mean, your favorite prospect? Absolutely. By my estimation, you are far more likely to achieve the prestige necessary to join the Sith than any oh, of the others. Oh, thank you. As a matter of fact, I am so certain of that that I'm willing to offer you an opportunity of the once-in-a-lifetime variety. Would you like to hear it? Absolutely. Good. I do so adore someone who's willing to take a chance. As I said, you're no doubt going to be the one whom Uthar chooses to become a Sith. With my help, of course. Once that occurs, he will take you into the Valley of the Dark Lords to the tomb of Nagasado to administer the final test. There you and I will be alone with him. The perfect time to, shall we say, arrange for a change in the Academy's leadership. What's so important about this tomb? The tomb is an ancient ruin on the surface that was visited years ago by Darth Revan Me. and Darth Malak. They discovered a star map there of great importance. You don't say. Well, the Master loves tombs, don't you, Master? Reaching that map, as they did, is part of the final test. At any rate, it is not the tomb that is important. That Uthar will be alone is what is important. You want me to kill him? Is that such a daunting prospect? It is not as if I am asking you to perform the task alone. Or as if you will get nothing out of it. Master Uthar cannot prevail against us both. That's all there is to it. It is a very simple matter. Very well, I agree. I'm so glad you see it my way. I will begin to make preparations for your final test. Your only worry now is to get there. Don't disappoint me. Yes, can you tell me about the code of the Seth? I can help you understand it. Would you like to hear it? Peace is a lie. There is only passion. Through passion, I gain strength. Through strength, I gain power. Through power, I gain victory. Through victory, my chains are broken. The Force shall free me. Simple words, yet easily misunderstood. Yeah, I think I got it. I am not surprised. The Force is strong with you. Master it, and it shall serve you well. Uh, tell me about yourself, if we're going to be working together. About myself? I am originally from Slaheron, if you must know. I was a slave to a cruel master, Omish the Oh, ha. Huh. I'm sure you don't need to know more. Alright, well, I'll be going. You have had an excellent start. Go, gain more... Where do we go? Master Ufar! Greetings, young one. You have much to do yet. You have gained little pre prestige. You will have to work quickly if you hope to best the others. I know the code of the Seth. Then finish the code as I speak it. Peace is a lie. That is only... Passion. Through passion, I gain... Strength. Through strength, I gain... A power. Through power, I gain... Victory. Through victory... 
My chains are broken. The Force shall free me. Yes, good. You have indeed learned the code of the Sith. Speaking the words and knowing the words are, are however, two different things. Tell me then, true or false, victory by any means is desirable. Check. We didn't ask about that. False. Well done. I will test you no more. You know the code. Very impressive. Go now. You have done well, but you have not impressed me enough to declare you the victor. I have matters to attend to. How do I gain prestige? Oh, it is no more complicated than I said. Perform impressive deeds, or bring me a suitably valuable artifact from the Valley of the Dark Lords. Oh, so it's a popularity contest, basically. Wonderful. Really, however, you should seek out Euthura and get her advice. She is your trainer, after all, yes? Very well. You have impressed me. Definitely a good start. Uh, can I switch out my party? Nah. I was kind of wanting to bring Jahani with me. Alright, Yafura. I understand you have impressed Master Uthar at least a little. That is good. We are one step closer toward completing my plan. Were I you, I would not get too excited just yet. You still have plenty left to do. How do I gain more prestige? You must impress Master Uthar. Go to him with news of your deeds, or artifacts you have discovered. There are a group of students who refused an order by Master Uthar to execute a group of civilians in the colony. Uthar declared that they were to be executed themselves, but the students escaped and fled before the order could be carried out. We are certain that they have not left Korriban, no doubt they have not gotten far and are simply in hiding. We just do not know where, exactly. If you were to locate them and carry out Uthar's order, I am sure he would be most appreciative. Shall I go on? Yes, please. I would suggest you talk to the other prospective Sith and find one you can gain an advantage with. I believe Lasho would be an excellent choice. She is too trusting. I have little doubt you could talk her into letting you help her somehow just make sure it is you who gains the advantage not her be ruthless if you must that is the only thing that will impress uthar the only other idea i can suggest to you is that you head into the valley of the dark lords on the surface there are ancient ruins there which can be explored it's possible you might find some artifacts or information in them which would please uthar it's difficult to say for certain yeah, you mentioned you were from Slaherion. I did. I also said that you didn't need to know more. Why are you asking? Just like to know more about you, that's all. I see. Very well. I suppose there's no harm in the tale. As I said, I was originally a slave to one of the Huts. The Huts control everything on Slaheron, and a slave is nothing to them. I was determined not to be nothing. One night when the drunken worm had me alone in his chambers, I stabbed him and escaped. You could have choked him out. I stole onto a cargo ship and was not discovered by the crew until they reached the next system. They left me for dead on a desolate planetoid, alone. But that was fine by me. I was glad to be anywhere other than Slayron. It was not luck that I was eventually rescued, of course. The Force was strong with me, though I didn't know that at the time. Not until the Jedi told me, that is. A Jedi found you? I'd rather not discuss it. Perhaps another time. Is there something else you needed? Alright, well, we'll be going. I hope to see you again. Hey there. Oh. Uh, hello. I don't remember seeing you here before. My name is Kel. Kel Alguin. Is something wrong? I... 
Oh, uh, nothing. You sure? Yes, my master always says I'm too trusting, too willing to show weakness. You're a Sith, so I, I really shouldn't, you know. But I'm not a Sith yet. Oh, I know that. I mean, you aren't yet, but you intend to be. I mean, you're just like everyone else here. And you're not. Well, I, 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 I didn't mean it like that. Well, how do you mean it then? I, I shouldn't trust you. I, I can't trust you. Can I? Sure you can. I just don't feel I belong here. I thought maybe I did at first, but now... I don't know. I just have so many doubts. Doesn't feel right. Perhaps you don't belong. But where would I go then? What would I do? Have you thought about the Jedi? Uh, I, I don't know. I never really thought about it. Maybe I should seek it out. Give it a try. Thank you. Thank you so much. Uh, we don't have anyone security. Right, let's find that last show, Lassie. And, uh... I know she didn't like us, but she'll probably come round. Hey there. You? I remember you from the colony. I can't believe you actually made it into the academy. I remember you. I challenge you to a duel. Nah, 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 let's, let's play it subterfuge. Are you trying to become a Sith as well? Just figure that out, did you? <laughs> it just so happens that I have a surefire way of pulling ahead in this little contest of ours. You don't really have a chance. Perhaps we could work together? Now, where are you going with this, I wonder? Help me get it? I don't know. Hmm. I suppose I could use some help. The artifact I know of certainly won't be easy to take. But why should I work with you? Would Force Persuade really work? I mean, we are dealing with a Force Sensitive. I've always wanted to work with a beautiful woman. Flattery, is it? I suppose it's possible that Master Uthar could award both of us prestige. We'd be ahead of the others, for sure. Unfortunately, the Holocron lies in the gullet of a Tukata mother. I can arrange for us to meet her, but you're going to have to help me in putting her down. That makes sense to you? Go into the valley when you're prepared enough. I'll be amongst the central pillars near the north end. See you there. Remember, the central pillar's in the valley. I'll be waiting, so don't take too long. Hello there, Mikael. It's a bad year to try and become a Sith, you know. I've got it all, all wrapped up. What makes you so sure? You think I would tell you? Have my brain started dribbling out of my nose or something. You could at least give me a hint. Hmm. I guess there's no harm in it. Word has it that Master Yuthar gives big points for Sith artifacts that are brought back from the Valley. The Valley? The Valley of the Sith Lords. You know, where the Academy does all its excavating. If you really don't know, just go out the east exit and you'll see. Ready. Yes. Alright, well, we're gonna have to explore then. Uh, 
Is that Damon here? Word is that one of our experimental droids went mad and escaped and is hiding in the ruins. Oh, really? Uh, who are you? Yeah, you speak like a Twi'lek. Ah, okay, fair enough. No, I'm not sure. Anything I should watch out for? Runda di hotonga kun hunka bi. Wanna kun bez ching palamule tonking ba. Mucha shak pa kat. Alright, I'll be going. Greetings. Well, we revisit this in uh, KOTOR 2. Yes? All right, here we go. Taste my blade! Experience the free sure beating! Well, I'll visit that cave later. Time to go raid some tombs, it seems. The tomb of Marco Ragnos, eh? One of the few people that can never be used in a Star Wars versus match. True story. Like we're talking Darth Maul, only man to kill Liam Neeson. Oh, heads up. Pia! Taste my blade. Quaka. Aya. Good thing we're masters of the research. All right. How many is there?
Take that. All I know is the circle is now complete. Oh, hang on. Sorry about that, folks. We had a little, um, glitch in the system, I think. Sorry about that, folks. Uh, I think I need to get a new cable. his security again. One. On it. Damn. On it. Damn. On it. Uh, hey there, guys and gals. Uh, sorry, I'm going to have to end the video here. Uh, it keeps acting up. I'm going to have to figure out what's wrong with it. Um, thanks for watching anyway. Please like, comment, and subscribe. Uh, please follow me on Facebook, Twitter, and Google+. And you can also send me an email at stillwinstonilvj at gmail.com. And hopefully I'll be back with more content. Until then, take care. See you later.